British multinational retailer Marks & Spencer has announced that it's completely pulling out of Russia. The company has also cautioned investors that the sharp rise in inflationary pressure could slow down its profit growth this year. Let's take a look at the news and the stock's performance. Earlier in March, Marks & Spencer suspended shipments to its stores in Russia on account of complex franchise deals preventing it from fully suspending its business. Although the retailer is now saying that it'll fully exit the Russian market at a cost of a hefty 31 million pounds. M&S reported that the new financial year will start at a lower level and it expects to stay lower throughout the year due to the rising cost of living crisis, end of the business rates holiday and the full withdrawal from Russia. As it stands, the company operates around 48 stores and has around 1,200 employees in the country, which are managed by a Turkish company, FIBA. Hundreds of global businesses have already withdrawn their operations from Russia since the invasion began in February, including Shell, McDonald's, Coca-Cola, Apple and Starbucks. The sales warning came as Marks & Spencer reported a profit before tax of £391 million for the year. That is compared to a loss of £209 million the previous. And looking at its share price performance, M&S's value has depreciated by 5.45% over the past year. Market cap of the company stands at £2.7 billion. Pounds. Now that you're up to speed, give us a sub and hit that bell icon to stay on top of it. I'm Holly Shields for Kakai Media.